welcome to TJ Ray's Kitchen. Um, I've been watching Rachel Ray lately, so that's where I've been inspired. When he isn't working on his skills to find the end zone, TJ Thorpe likes to satisfy his sweet tooth. I like to bake probably because, like I said, my mom is really, like that's her forte. Kind of helps satisfy my sweet tooth. But uh, yeah, just kind of gives me a little piece of home whenever like I'm not feeling, I'm feeling a little homesick or I feel like I miss my family. Drop those in there. You don't want to add too much because then it's going to just be too chocolatey and too many conflicting flavors and you don't want that. Thorpe began his college career at North Carolina, where he was recruited by Butch Davis. He excelled on special teams in 2011 and was named a finalist for the Johnny Rogers Award given to the nation's top returner. Well, I just always have been like a natural returner. It's always something that came easy to me. Um, I always like to watch, you know, the Devin Hesters of the world, the Dante Halls. Just being able to change the game in one play, not have to put a drive together. And, and I feel like, you know, from that year, just having fun. And that's the thing I've been really making sure I've gotten back to is go out, have fun, let chips fall where they may. And usually when you do that, you have success. Thorpe battled ankle injuries throughout his time in Chapel Hill, but gives credit to his parents for their encouragement and optimism in his quest to return to the field at full speed. If you, it's something you want to do to make sure nobody can stop you from doing, the only person to stop you is yourself. Try to just silence all the naysayers, the people who don't think that I could, just show them that I can and show myself that I can. With one year of eligibility remaining and a desire to play elsewhere, TJ remembered all the reasons why UVA was one of his favorite destinations when he was coming out of high school. They were very genuine, very family oriented. That was one thing that always stuck in my mind and that was a big part of my decision. He, he contacted us and, and said, hey listen, I'm looking to, to, to play somewhere else to finish my career. Um, Virginia was always close, near and dear to my heart. My parents loved the school. When he came, and, and first start talking about you know who he is and what he has to offer the team. He got on the board in Coach Fairchild's room and started writing formations up and started writing the protections that each player on the offense, what all 11 guys do on a certain play. So he talked about all those things before he got to the wide receiver, his, his spot on the board and what he had to do. Thorpe's personality made for a seamless transition in the locker room. He got acclimated to this team really fast. I mean, you know, guys, they, they liked him. You know, they, they liked being around him. And, and those things are important. When you have a new guy that comes in, you know, that's trying to find his way, he found his way very quickly because he bonded with a lot of players. He's uh, fun to interact with. And, and again, his work ethic is, uh, is second to none as far as that. And I think that comes with just being a fifth year guy and knowing, you know what, I've got one more shot to get this right. Following 15 spring practices, the 2015 spring game was Thorpe's first opportunity to showcase his abilities. He did not disappoint as he totaled 104 all-purpose yards and scored a touchdown. I felt like that spring was to get me back to where I should have already been. And now it's time to take off really and really excel and get to where I want to be. Thorpe hopes to fill the void left by the graduation of Darius Jennings and Miles Gooch, who combined to catch 51 passes a year ago. I like to play in space, so I had a little dynamic there. And I've had experience carrying the ball, so you know, a little out the jet sweeps and things of that nature can also help. Just to go throughout each day and just make sure I just have as much fun as possible, um, enjoy the guys I'm around, and, and then, you know, I feel like all the other stuff, you know, that'll take care of itself. But the best part is my mom's going to be so proud when she watches this. <laughs> Thorpe hopes his final season turns out as well as his brownies. Mm. I tell you what, I'm, I'm, oh my God. Cut the camera off. Oh my God. I need to have a moment. <laughs>